Hello everybody, welcome to Crash Bandicoot 4. It's about time. I know it's Halloween, but I needed to play this as I've waited, was it 18 years for a sequel? I, I had to. I had to start it now. I just, I needed it. <laughs> Crash Bandicoot. At last, I, the great Neocortex, have you I'll play right three eventually. And now, the final blow! <laughs> Hush, simpleton. Face it, Entropy. It's going to fail. Again! At least Uka Uka and I attempt to free us from this prison. I won't sit idly by and listen to your inane ramblings for another decade! Shoo. <laughs> oh, Kook is down. Is he dead? Leave him. He served his purpose. <laughs> wow, not even a thank you. <laughs> Great power has awoken. Crash? I fear it portends an event of reality shattering proportions. I feel it emanating from insanity peak. Quickly, we must go! Crash! 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 I'm liking the cartoony aspect of it. This is really nice. Like, this is how I want a modern crash to look. Okay, so, straight at it. So we got the spinning going. We already got the big spin going, looks like. What we got on the TV? Oh, you can play all the original crash games. That's cool. Okay, so we got the double jump by default. How's the, okay, how's the slide jump feel? Okay. Oh, look at this little Spyro plushie. Oh, that's cute. Oh, bye. I guess I wasn't supposed to hit it. What else we got here? The fridge on the mag or the magnet from the fridge spell out crunch. That's pretty cool. Oh, cool. And there's like a little like shadow underneath that like little circle that shows you where you're gonna land. That's pretty cool. Oh, there we go. We can put them all on there. I'm just getting trophies for everything, okay. Cool. But yeah, it's got like a more like, almost like an action figure aspect to it, which I really like. The Insane Trilogy went for like more realistic proportions, but their Toys for Bob is finally doing their own thing with this, and this is awesome. I love the way this looks. The music still sounds, ooh, sounds great. I have to get used to the response time. I'm still used to the Insane Trilogy's physics. Is a HUD? Okay. 100, 104 boxes on the first level? Okay. Oh! K was not ready for him. Oh, we have a death counter. That's cool. So one of the things that they show on there at the, uh, at the beginning, you have the choice of either playing the classic way, which is just like lives and 100 Wampa Fruit means an extra life and you can get game overs and stuff, or you can get the modern mode, which is just basically infinite lives. That's what we're rolling with for my own sanity, because game overs are not my friend. Oh, is there a box back there? Yeah, okay. That guy's a dick. Okay, come here, little warthog buddy. There we go. I died to the like third enemy of the game. I guess I've had worse. Okay, there's a little pit right there. I like that they're like actually green poisonous pits and not just holes in the ground. Jump on TNT to start countdown. Acting like I don't know how to play a Crash Bandicoot game. There we go. It's so pretty! Oh my god! Okay, hang on. I'm enjoying everything. Just give me a minute here. Look how gorgeous this is. And they're still taken in with like the linear hallway design. Oh shit, move, move, move. I'm too enamored by how beautiful this game is to notice the dangers in front of me. Did he just put himself in the box? 
Yeah, you didn't need to put yourself in the box. You could have just helped me out. That's a big old mean spider. Oh, he's gonna follow me, isn't he? Okay, Ooh. Oh, I see. The poison, the dripping poison is what's gonna get me. Oh, boxes. Wow, those are right in front of my face. There we go. Does the spin jump work how I think it does? Like, okay, so jump, but then... No, it's the same height. It's not gonna be the same. It's not the same exploit as the insane trilogy. Oh, I did not see that was TNT. Okay. Are these gonna fall? Oh, dang it. Okay. I was looking at the wrong shadow. Well, good. I'm glad to know that there's a numeric value to show how badly I'm gonna be at this game. Alright, we gotta get past this guy, which that's all he's gonna do. That's fine. See, now that we have this, we'll need a remake of the Spyro, or not remake, rather, because we got the uh, Spyro Reignited trilogy, but we're going to need a brand new Spyro game to complement this. Especially since they have them both together in Crash Team Racing, maybe we can get a collaborative game going that isn't a minigame uh, montage on the Game Boy Advance, because, you know, that was fun. Whoa. It's like ghosts coming out of it. What are they? Natives? Oh, oh. What's happening? Oh, we're just sliding? Do I need to hit something? Other than boxes? It's pretty. Oh, no, I missed a box. I got a gem? For what? For the Wumpa Fruit? They said there was like three of them in this. Are there three gems per level now? Oh. Ow! Okay. Oh, I have to get used to having the double jump already. This is really neat. Okay. It's a crawl. I crawled too long. Okay, so you can slide, then do a double jump too. Okay. Interesting. Oh, there's a bonus. Wait, wait, y'all calm down. There's a bonus here. Where are we going? Only eight boxes? Alright, that's not so bad. I wonder if the... I, I imagine the bonus Wumpa Fruit will go towards... What? Oh, I see, okay. Hold X for a bigger bounce? Interesting. Oh, no, 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 no. Ah, did it too early. Okay, so you can... So instead of pressing X at the right time on those, you have to hold X to get the bigger bounce. Got it! Got it! Still learning the game. I cannot get over how lush the environment is. I love when games... Like, have this, these big, bright colors and these wacky set pieces that... Granted, I, I just came off of Bloodborne, so I'm used to everything being gray. So, this is... Is that just a couch? Oh, hey! There's Tana. Tana's stuff there. That's cool. Wonder where she went. Okay, so I got a... Okay, so that is for uh, the Wumpa Fruit. Okay, so you get three gems. So you have to collect Wumpa Fruit. Okay. Taking the side road. They give you trophies for everything, don't they? This way, got some big glowy rocks. Looks like there were ghosts coming out of here, so I'm not gonna have to deal with some ghost monsters. Whoa. Okay. One thing, that, another thing this game is doing, those are going to fall. Hit it, hit it. Oh, God! It fell so fast! I wasn't ready! I do like how uh, we get all these cool, like, cinematic angles of the levels. That's really cool. It's reminding me of, like, an, uh, what's it called? Oh, get out of here, get out of here. Woo, no, I lost that box. Oh, well. It reminds me of, uh, like, it, if you get good enough at this, the Impossible game, if you ever played that on, like, phones. I think it was on computers, where basically you're just a square who just runs through 
it's almost like a rhythm based game that's what i'm trying to say it's a rhythm based game it's gonna be like because you're gonna have these people speed run this because you know that they have the platinum relics in here and all that okay no buddy you're not gonna throw that at me okay yeah you know they're gonna have relics in here so you're gonna have to speed run through all of this and it makes it a really nice backdrop to be able to have while you're trying to figure out how to speed run this which oh shit okay no 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 okay it also could be pretty distracting though as you're trying to get boxes and it might not work out for you <laughs> I missed two I missed two I know exactly which two I missed too. One on the vine and one... Gems unlock skins. Earn gems by breaking crates, getting wampa, finding hidden gems, or being levels in three lives or less. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, there's six of them. Holy cow. Okay. So you get three gems for wampa fruit. I mean, I'm guessing for just this level. Getting all the boxes. Uh, three or less deaths. And then hidden. The hidden requirement or is just a the gem itself is hidden. I don't know. But we're at Insanity Peak now. <laughs> it's so cartoony. This is such a cartoony game, and I am about it. Whoa, okay. Golden Wumpa crates give 25 Wumpa fruit. Cool. Looks like we got some vine platforming. I'll take those. Okay, so you can hold X on any crate. It doesn't have to be just those metal ones. Can I climb up it? Okay, that's not gonna help me. Checkpoint. More natives. These are different looking natives than I remember. Okay, so another vine there. It's not a vine, it's a rope, but it does the same thing. Somebody's upset. I'm hearing some big roars happening. Hope I didn't miss something up there. So now you got me looking for all kinds of stuff that I normally wouldn't be. Okay, let's chill out, big guy. There we go. Oh, that works. That's a big wampa fruit. That is a honking wampa. Give it to me. Ooh, that was a lot. Okay, so those are gonna fall. They got ghost hands holding them up, okay. So we do have some ghosts happening. Okay, anything cool under that box? Nope. <laughs> what is he doing? What are you swinging at up there, buddy? I don't see nothing. Oh, this music is killer too. Oh shit! It's just really, it's, it's like, it's really reminiscent of the original music, but it's got this nice like, I don't know, darker, edgier tone to it, which I am totally about. I'm that guy who listens to like video game music all the time. I've got a bunch of albums saved on my phone because, you know, people still save music on their phone, right? Outside of Spotify. So I usually like to get the game albums. Where are we going? 12 boxes this time. All right. Get that Wampa. Nothing up there. Hmm. Wall hole. Oh. Okay, so crouch jumping still works. Got it. I forgot that was a trick. I didn't really use crouch jumping all that much. Yes. Give me that one. Oh, so that is the gold Wampa. Okay, so gold Wampa is big Wampa. Okay, so five jumps for the crates still. And those don't blow up when they land. It's an interesting change. Give me all them wompas. Ah, oh, okay. That didn't work out like I wanted it to. It's fine. We got what we needed. One gem down. Almost two gems down. Okay, I'm liking this this platforming going on. Okay, go go. We got like ghost ham, ghost skeleton hamsters on running on the wheels. That's pretty cool. That TNT, it's like an actual crate. I always thought the, the TNT and nitro crates were like some kind of metal. Oh, 
Okay. And these aren't even close to the last one of boxes I need to get. Okay. So we gotta play this carefully. Whoa, okay. I'm behind. Okay, I lost the rhythm there. That was my first death. It's fine, it's fine. We're good. Woo, okay. We got it. Jump, jump. No, no, no! I didn't mean to jump on the box. No, don't die to that. Oh, the Wumpa Fruit stay with you. That's cool. Okay, carefully now. Go. 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 Eee! No! No! <laughs> okay, we got it. We're good. No, 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 no. Oh, how do you get them? Oh. What is that? Interesting. There's a... That's a hint to the hidden gem, I guess? Okay, so start on the left corner, work your way around, and then get to the middle and there'll be a gem. Got it. Okay. So we need to start there. And you hear that, okay. Woo, no! Okay, so we're not getting the death gem. Okay, we got it. Did you hear the little xylophones going off? Oh, never mind. You get the same amount of gems. I'm just really close. Or, same amount of wolf I'm just really close to that gem, I guess. Okay. Alright, forget about that right now. Ah! Oh my god! That's... That's tough. It doesn't look tough. But, man. It is. Alright, I'm just getting used to these new physics here. I'm glad there's no game overs. Dang it. Okay. I'm glad there's no game overs. <laughs> okay. So we won't do that again. Okay. Careful now. Got that one. Got that one. Okay. Got it. Oh, no! No! I was right there! <laughs> Come on! Ah! We got it. We got it. This one. Forget the boxes. Not worried about them right now. It's fine. Oh, I thought I was too early. Oh, it's a color gem! Oh, sick! Okay. That's better than I thought. Okay. Now we can go back for these. Woo! No, 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 no! Ah! Woo! Okay. Let me think. There we go. There we go! Ah, oh, that's what I wanted. Who are you? Yeah, just just take them. You're fine. Yeah, I feel the same way. Let's say you. Oh, let's say you're not falling. You float. All right, we got the big blue mask. What is it? That's a big ghost. <laughs> Lonnie Lowly. Okay. All right, I guess. Oh. All right, time to go. I ain't fighting that. We can't fight that. Oh, there's a gem. Oh, I missed. Wait, go ahead and kill me. There's a gem right there. I'm not going to miss it. Not when it's like insultingly obvious where it is. There we go. That's the hidden gem. Wasn't very hidden. Okay, that's a big ghosty goo. Why have we never seen him before in the other games? He never was a bigger presence? Maybe they're only a thing when... Ooh, can I do a spin? Okay. Okay, you got like a spin, like, down kick. Uh-oh, I missed that box. Okay, so I guess he counts the box... His... I wonder if that counts as the box is getting killed when he does it. It's hard to... S what?! Okay, I thought I had to still keep going. Well, it's a, I'm glad I got a checkpoint. 
No, why did I do that? Why did I do that? I'm an idiot. I didn't. Uh, mm, yeah, that was my bad. There we go. Let's learn from our mistakes. There we go. Oh, he's still there. I love that little spin, like, down kick. That's gonna be his uh, down smash. He's gonna be in smash. I know he is. He has to be. Oh, I missed all those. Does it count? He counts them. Good. And I'll take that box gem too. <laughs> Alright, so I died too much. Reality shattering proportions. Okay. Got the color gem. Oh, that's Unicorn Coco. I needed the last gem for that. So, okay. So, if you get all the gems, you get costumes. Right. I forgot already. <laughs> Oh, he's still coming. That mask is Invader Zim. I don't remember the actor's name, but that's Invader Zim. She's got a tablet now, not a, not a laptop anymore. Lonnie Loli? If the quantum mask has returned, then... Hey, Aku, how's it going? Is that a quantum rift? <laughs> you guys didn't see that before? It appears to be a door between dimensions. Yes, yes, the kind we keep shut. Huh. We have to go through. Not De Debbie oh, Dairyberry isn't and Coco this time. This before some putz with a big evil plan and a bigger ego does something monumentally stupid. Uh. <laughs> 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 unknowingly paved the way for our bright future. Once my rift generator is complete, dominion over all of time and space will be within our grasp. Engine, Embryo, you had some little projects you wanted to tell me about? Master, my mechanical marvel would hypnotize you and I. I love their redesigns. Make me and them unstoppable. Right, you're fine, sure. Have fun with your ray guns or whatever. <laughs> Ah. Hasten your steps. By my calculations, our enemies are already moving against us. And we will prevail. I like what they did with him. I guess he's the he's the main villain of this game. As opposed to Uka Uka. I'm all about it. This is so cool. I'm so happy this exists. I feel like I live in the best timeline. <laughs> no, no pun intended there, no play on words intended. Oh, interesting. You got like a Mario 3 style map going. Okay. Welcome to the dimensional map. Here you can select levels to play, switch between Crash and Coco, change skins, and replay levels to take on time trials. Excellent. Okay. Cool. That's quite a different environment. Looks like there's another mask over there. Cool. So do I have any skins? No, I don't have any skins. What is this? Beat the game. Oh, I can't. I can't preview them. So, what is that one? Oh. Okay, caveman. Sun to activate. I have an Activision account. Oh no. Oh, I hate that. It's looking like Ninja. No, thank you. I didn't know I had these. I don't know what I did to earn them, but I love these robot outfits. That's cute. I like that. Nah, we're going. We're robots now. Robo Crash, give it to me. Yes. Okay, that's what we're doing. That's what we're doing here. No, no, I already did this one. Let's go. The hazardous wastes. The year 2084. Beat the level to earn six. Gems. Oh, it's like an engine skin. Okay, so this is engines area. A real grind. Interesting. So we don't have like the, the warp hub like the other games. This is just like a straight up Mario 3 walk around the path, pick the levels you want to play. I dig it. I dig it. Glad we're just so casually using those willy nilly. Correct. Now my brother Ricardo is around here somewhere. Welcome to the show, 
<laughs> Behold the aforementioned putts. Don't worry. We have a thing where we fight, he loses. It's a well established dynamic. It's true. Not this time, I've got a backstage pass for you to get up close and personal with my weapon of mass percussion. Come ready to rock. What? Has he got like a concert going on? Am I about to play Guitar Hero against Engine? I'm all about that. R2 a triangle to phase world. Oh, interesting. The mask phases. Okay. That's the neat mechanic. That's gonna be oh it messes with the like the envir environment environment too. Interesting. Oh, that's dirty. Okay. Oh no! Okay. Okay. What? I thought I hit it. Okay. That's gonna be fun. Okay. This is gonna get take some getting used to. R2 can do it too. Okay. R2 might be my best bet here. But I gotta get these boxes. Ah! Okay. Ah! Oh, that's cool. Okay. This has the potential of having some crazy platforming. <laughs> We're having like a battle of the bands. What's down there? Did y'all see that down there? What was that? I saw something. I saw something big down there. I know I did. I just didn't see. Yes! What the hell was that? They got like big robot sand sharks. Wait, what? Okay, that's interesting. So, we'll take out these boxes. Whoa! Oh, I forgot to do it almost. Okay. Jump on. Bounce off. Bounce off again. Alright. Hey, Bo, oh, you're an enemy. Okay. I was gonna leave you alone. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're like... Engineized sand sharks. Okay, so those sink down. Does the explosion hurt? Interesting! Okay, so it completely negates the boxes. Even the explosions. Alright. Why did I think that was the right time? Okay, I didn't think it was going to come up twice. Okay, so two. And now we can go. Okay, it doesn't do anything right now. Okay. Okay, okay. Go, go, go. Nitro crates explode on touch. Well, it's a good thing I can phase them. Okay. What's the point of that steel crate? Is there something here that I'm not seeing? Ugh, no? Okay. Oh, okay. Did I miss that? Oh, is they gonna let me do it off a double jump? Oh, perfect. And alley oop! <laughs> so cool. Phase it out. Ah, oh, I'm loving this. I'm not even like I don't have anything witty to say right now. I'm just in awe. And phase it in, and we're good to go on that. Oh, and he's gone. Okay, so we used him for everything he needed to. Okay, was that all that was up there? Did I miss something? Okay, I'm paranoid. How many boxes are in this level? 153. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna break the megaphone. See, there's gonna be some crazy phasing with that too. Okay. Oh no, no! I, oh, oh, I thought you had to hold it. I didn't realize there was just to push the button. I goofed that. But what's? I wonder if I can. Is there anything up there at all? I don't know. Belly flop still works pretty good. I feel like this game is running a little slower than it should. I don't know. I, can't, I think it's in 30 frames per second, but I feel like it needs to be running in 60. Maybe that's just me. I mean, it still looks good. And up. And get those boxes and down. 
And up! <laughs> okay, so no double jumping on the rails. Good to know. Hit that one. Whoa, no, get it. Oh, dang it, I missed it. No, I guess I gotta die now. Or I guess I can come back for them later. Because I'm, I'm gonna have to get all these later. Because you know there's gonna be like a true ending tied behind all this. But if there's six... If there's six gems per level, I don't know how many levels there are. Usually they go off like 25 levels. Which even then, that's a lot. But I watched the trailer of this game. They talked about how uh, they had like inverted versions of levels too. So that makes me wonder if... Oh, I messed that up. Okay. Ah, ah! Okay, that circle is great. I have to get used to that. Uh, but the but the inverted levels are their own levels too, so I wonder... Are they also gonna have six more... Oh, no, I missed that. Are they gonna have six more uh, gems on there as well? Oh, that's temporary. Okay. Okay. This is gonna have a lot to it. <laughs> It's weird seeing 341. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Dang it. Well, I can't die anymore if I want that gem. <laughs> and alley -oop. All right, get that there. Oh, there's a box up there. Hang on, wait. Ah, oh, yes, okay. Didn't see that. Wow, they have these hidden, like, on the very edges of the map. Like, the where the camera, because you can't really control the camera other than like just doing a little bit like that. One, two, three. One, two, I missed that one again. And three. All right, let's try this again. Oh no, dang it. All right, get that box up top again. Or not. Or not. That's fine. Nah, I'm good. <laughs> I already missed some boxes, I think, so I'm not gonna get that 100% completion on that. But it's fine. It's fine. Come on. No? Alright. Whatever. Watch. I watch. I haven't missed any boxes, actually, so... Alright, let's go. Hit these. Ah, uh, okay. One, two. Missed that one. Nope, nope. Double jumps are weird. Hold it. There we go. Now we can get up on here, go down, grab this box, come up. There we go. There we go. Go down for that one. Up, jump, jump down again. This reminds me of, uh, I think it was Sly Cooper that had a section like this, kind of. You're grinding, like, with your little cane. That's what we really need, too, is a Sly Cooper, uh, revival. Because those games were awesome. What's he doing? You good over there, bud? No, well, you are now. Oh! <laughs> I thought I hit it. Let's try that again. Looks kind of like a weird Nina alien thing. Oh, we got the boy. I like that they all still speak gibberish. Okay, it's an interesting choice. I don't know why it's like that. Was there supposed to be a cool way to do that that I'm just not seeing? Okay. <laughs> Jump, then hit R2, then hit R2 again. I love this, and then it's not gonna kill me. So cool. No! Oh no! Okay. Okay. So that's gonna be tough. We start right here, so it works out. Can you just walk off this? No, okay. Come on, Lalu, Lanu, Lolly. <laughs> I don't know what your name is. Lonnie Lowly. And then we'll wait here, jump up, let it do its thing. 
Double jump again. There we go. I'm sure there was a, a faster way to do that, but here we are. Okay, so how do you get that? That's gonna be a hard one. No, I didn't hit R2 again. Oh, it's so hard. <laughs> this is only like the third level. This game's kicking my ass. Okay. Come on, Lanu, La, Lelu, Lalu. Person. Up. Oh. Actually, I already got the second one, so I don't even need to be there. That's just unnecessary danger. I can't wait to see people speed run through these and just absolutely dominate the course. That works. Okay, so I'm... How do I do this? Okay. There we go. Hold on, there's a box we still gotta get. There we go. Kill those. Come back. Don't need that anymore. Got the gold one. Awesome. Not gonna be enough for the third gem. Not yet. Do you get something for a hundred percent of the Wumper Fruit? Who is that? Oh, I don't need that. Mm. The minions are actually pretty cool. They're not just like the regular scientists or like random animals you find in the street. Oh, was well, that supposed to go up there? Ah, oh, crap. Nah, there's probably something up there. Let me... Yeah, there's definitely something up there. There's gotta be a box I can hit or something. Okay, so... Oh, there's a barrel right there. What does that lead to? Oh, maybe that's where I was supposed to drop off from. So this is gonna lead me up there, but then I gotta... Okay, never mind. Okay. So this is just a secret way to go. Mm, okay. If I get 152 boxes and know that I missed that one intentionally because I just decided not to, I'll be upset. That's fine. Oh no, I gotta play this game some more. <laughs> the horror. Yeah, this is where I'm supposed to drop off at. Got it. Give me them fruits. And there's that third gem. Boom. Okay. Gotta be very careful here. Let him do his thing. Yes. Oh shoot, he's a... Whoa, that was a mistake. I didn't really know what to do there. I guess I could have just killed the, the little runny boy and called it, but it's fine. There's a checkpoint right there, we'll make it. Just gotta make sure the shark does his thing so I can head out. Hey, there's our boy. Uh, oh, there's still something up there. Dang it, okay. Yeah, these boxes are very hidden. <laughs> Shut up, engine. Okay, and up, and up, and up. One, two, three, bammo. Alright. Oh, whoops. I like that they gave Engine this like Mad Max vibe. He kind of had this in like earlier games a little bit, but not like this though. How do I get to those? Oh, whoops. Okay. Because it actually makes me think of like Crash Team Racing. They released a, uh, a map. It wasn't for Engine, but it was Mega Mix, which was partly Engine. If you ever knew that monster, it was like a. Con there's the hidden gem. Oh, I messed it up. I goofed it. I goofed it. I want that gem. 
I want that gem. No, no, it's too late. <laughs> I want that one. But uh, yeah, Mega Mix was a mix of Cortex, Tiny, Dingo Dial, and Engine. And it was this horrific, horrific monster that really only appeared as a boss in I think one or two Crash games on the Game Boy Advance. He's a pretty obscure Crash villain, but everyone really liked the, the Game Boy games, so they brought him back as a character in the racing games, which- No! Ah! Oh, I did it again! I don't even know what I did wrong that time. But, the reason why I brought that up was because his level was very Mad Max inspired, and it had all kind of, like this kind of same like desert aesthetic, which I thought worked really well for the character, and it works really well for Engine by himself. Kind of a good juxtaposition, really, because, you know, mad scientist you didn't think would be hanging out in the desert with all this, like, scrapyard stuff. And, oh, there we go. Woo! Okay. Okay, so I missed 10, so not the worst. Still got, what, two gems? Three gems? I got four, okay. I'll take it. I'll take it for now. All right. Well, that is going to be our first episode of Crash Bandicoot 4. Still feels weird to say, but I am so happy. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye!